Hi everyone, I'm Queen Nerd and I'm back again with another Funko unboxing. But first, if you're enjoying my content, please subscribe to my channel and turn your post notifications on. Now, let's get into the video. Today, we will be unboxing the Funko Pops that I got from Winter Con. First up, we have a box from the Funko Shop that is a little bit larger than normal, but we're gonna figure it out and we're gonna show y'all who's inside. Okay, y'all ready? All right, open it up. All right, let's get this paper out of here and show y'all who it is. See that? Let's get the smaller one out first. And then let's get Luffy. Yes, y'all. So this is our second Luffy and I'm just going to inspect it to see if it came as good as the first one. Okay, so the first thing I'm gonna look at is the flag on the ship. It looks to be pretty intact, which I'm happy about. Nothing in here seems to be broken. Um, the box itself seems pretty good which I'm excited about I don't hear nothing like moving around clicking clack it in in there which is that works for me so I'm really hyped that we got two good condition Luffy on Sunny because y'all know that I love me some one piece <laughs> so now let's get into this smaller pop all right let's show y'all up it's upside down okay now let's show y'all it is Jack from Black Clover. C Captain Jack from Black Clover. Oh my god, he looks so cool. He looks like he should glow in the dark though. It's okay, he still looks really awesome. So now let's get him into some table time so y'all can really see him. I really love Black Clover. I watch it and I read it. And Jack is one of those characters. He might not be my like top five from the series but I do enjoy watching him and Yami on screen just like get at each other they be fighting like crazy and they friends I think they gets crazy they don't care time or place like real definition of on site like I said I feel like it looks like it should glow in the dark although it doesn't it look like it should and I really hope that they make more because I want Charmy that pop is going to be absolutely adorable I want like little Charmy and I want Charmy in her adult form I would be so <laughs> Hi. So the next package we're gonna get into is also from the Funko shop. Let me show y'all what's inside this one. All right, same size box, let's do it. All right, two double pack sorters, let's get them both out of here. Starting with the first one, in here, also upside down, we have Summon Skull from Yu-Gi-Oh! and Velsartha from Star Wars, okay? Let's get these two out of here and get them into table time first. Okay, y'all. I'm going to show y'all a little bit of this. But, yeah. This came like this. I couldn't tell when I first opened it because it's just showing me the front of the box, which looks perfectly fine. Um, but, yeah. This was disappointing the sorter wasn't damaged the other pop in there wasn't damaged but we reached out to Funko so hopefully we get a replacement but yeah that was kind of weird because when I opened it you really can't tell from the front and sometimes when I get two pops and a sorter like that together I don't take it out until I go to do table time normally it's not a problem but yeah I wish I would have taken it out on camera at that part but I'll keep y'all posted. <laughs> now let's get Vel Sartha into some table time. This is a character from Andor and like me, you guys may have recognized her as the same actress who plays the waif from Game of Thrones. Hated her. <laughs> but in Andor, she ends up working with Andor and I won't tell you how that played out just so I don't give it all away but yeah she was a pretty big character in the show and there was like a surprise moment in it with her character but I won't give all of the show away you still gotta go watch it but she's a pretty cool character in the show 
like that. Instead of giving the whole show away, we're just going to move on to the next order that came in this box. Okay, let's get it open. Y'all know I hate these boxes. <laughs> but they protect the pop, so I'm okay. Oh my god, Dolph and President Loki. I am so excited to have this. So let's get Dolph into table time first. Luckily, these two were good as well because I, I don't know if I can take it. Simpsons, you guys. I am so, I feel like they do a Simpsons pop at every con now, but it could just be my brain lying to me, but I, 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 fe I feel that way. <laughs> but i'm really excited to have this the detail on this from the little to the bang to his socks sitting perfectly over the sneakers like i really love the simpsons line and every time funko releases one i'm getting it so i'm really hyped to have this and i can't wait to see what Simpsons pops come out this year because there's still a lot of characters that we don't have that we need and then a lot of variants of characters that we have that we don't have like different outfits treehouse of horror so I'm I'm looking forward to what Simpsons has in store for us this year let's get President Loki into some table time Loki so so I really enjoyed the first season of this and season two was supposed to be coming out sometime this year I'm really looking forward to it because I know it's about to be good you know I'm so excited they can release so many characters from this show like so many Loki so many other characters big characters without you know spoiling it for anyone who hasn't seen it but I'm, I'm really hyped for what they could do pop wise and what they're going to do show wise with everything being the way it is like everything is messed up right now and it's it's, it's wild ridiculous <laughs> but it'll only get better from here so I'm <laughs> I'm looking for all of the chaos and fun that's gonna happen when we get season two have you guys watched season one of the series yet did you enjoy it did you not enjoy it let me know in the comments the next package we have here is from fye let me show you who it is okay let's open it up let's see oh hush from batman box looks good and the pop itself looks pretty good let's get him into some table time okay so i have a weird relationship with dc it's not my favorite and i don't collect every single dc pop ever but batman the flash titans there's more uh, we do some Wonder Woman, we do some Superman. There there are a few characters that we go hard for. And Batman and all of his villains are one of them. So when we saw Hush in the WinterCon lineup, we were like, yep, gotta get that. And I think the pop looks really, really awesome. I like how they captured his angry expression even under all the wraps. I think that's really fire that they could do that. And I love that aspect of it. I like the back of the box, how it's just so simple and straightforward it, it it looks really really nice like that and i'm happy it came in really really good condition our next box is from walmart so let's just jump right into it all right let's show y'all who it is since they didn't put in the corner spider-man oh i cannot get this can't get it out oh <laughs> struggling oh my god this i uh, y'all i love this i am so excited all right let's get this into some table i love spider-man he is one of my favorite marvel characters of all time and this this funko pop is really really dope 
down to all of the colors that just pop on his suit the action pose that they put him in the way the foot is out like it it is perfect of a spider-man position that he would be in while he's like doing his spider thing <laughs> again another box that came in really really good condition which i'm hyped about walmart didn't make us buy a hard stack which thank you because sometimes when they put the hard stacks in it will damage the pop but yeah spider-man looks so good he might be my favorite so far. i'm lying goofy <laughs> forgot about luffy that fast but he might be my second favorite that i unbox in this video today he looks so good we have one more package to unbox so let's just do that right now this one right here is from amazon and the outer box got damaged but luckily the pop came with a sorter so it's still in pretty good shape but we gonna open this one right now mm -mm -mm. Damn. perfect all right let's show y'all who it is is it the top yup oh my god this this one look at her oh my goodness and the box is perfect she is perfect all right you guys let's get raven into some table time you guys raven is one of my favorite characters from all of dc and not just because she wears purple but her whole mood and everything about her i absolutely love it honestly titans is one of my favorite entities to consume not teen but <laughs> the titans the animated version dc dc will nail some animation okay they have been killing the superhero animation game since since like marvel got the movie game on lock but dc they be bodying with the animation so from then i've loved raven and this pop is just the detail the colors her floating i all of it it's just marvelous <laughs> i am happy the box came in really good condition and i'm really really hyped about this one she looks so freaking good i have one more thing to show y'all this spinner right here the reason i am not unboxing him today but he is somehow in my possession is because we were lucky enough to get him from new york comic-con at the toy temple booth as you guys know i attended new york comic-con and the fig pin chalice collectible exclusives were going to be sold at the toy temple booth now when we got to the toy temple booth not only did they have the fig pin but they also had the chalice collectibles goku and ycc exclusive and chalice collectible winter con spinner so we have had spinner in our collection since early october i still wanted to add him in and give him some valid table time because i love spinner i pretty much love all of the characters in my hero academia villains included i genuinely hate all for one but he's a great villain to hate so spinner looks fire and i was super hyped that we like caught him early <laughs> because then we didn't have to worry about when WinterCon did come around trying to get him and what other pops they were gonna have. Before we wrap up this video, I wanted to remind everyone about the Funko Shop exclusive Samurai Brook giveaway once I get to 200 subscribers. So if you haven't subscribed already, please subscribe to my channel now. That way you'll be entered into the giveaway for this Samurai Brook Funko Shop exclusive. That's going to wrap up today's video if you enjoy watching please leave a like comment and subscribe if you haven't already also turn your post notifications on that way you'll be notified every single time i drop a new video as always you guys i will see you next time bye